Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, hi, my name is Madison and I post vlogs relating to me being a new grad labor and delivery nurse. I've shared my entire nursing experience so far. And if you're not already, make sure you guys follow me on my Instagram and my TikTok. I'm gonna put them right here, also down below. And before we get started into this vlog, I do want to say a huge thank you to Care Of for sponsoring today's video. So as always, I do have a discount code for you guys, which is an amazing offer. So all you guys have to do is go to takecareof.com and enter my code MADDYNJ50 for 50% off your first Care Of order. And I will put the link in the description and the information information down below for you guys. So if you guys do not know what Care Of is, Care Of is a subscription service that ships high quality personalized vitamins, supplements, and powders conveniently to your door every single month. All you have to do is take a short in-depth quiz about your health goals and lifestyle and you'll get personally tailored recommendations based on your answers. You can stick with the Care Of recommendations or you can change your packs up at any time. Care Of's products are made from good for you, clean ingredients that are backed by the latest science and research. You can feel good about what you're putting in your body. So I want to show you guys my little packs. Look how cute when they have my name on it and anything like with my name on it or like personalized just makes me feel special so oh, this is super cute and this I love the little box it comes in the little dispenser it's so easy for you to just pull out the pack for the day throw it in your bag and I love it it's a cute box too you can put it in your bathroom your kitchen your room anything like that so you don't forget to take them and it's just easy to grab it and go especially all of my nurse friends out there or anyone who is busy working or in school sometimes it's hard when you have a million different vitamins you want to take or supplements and it's just so easy to just grab it and go take it in the car and you have everything right here for you so again all you have to do is go to takecareof.com and use my code maddynj 50 for 50 percent off your first care of order i'm going to put all of that in the description down below again thank you so much care of for sponsoring today's video and so let's go ahead and get started with the vlog <laughs> So it is Saturday, April 9th, 11 o'clock p.m. I just got home. We had a little birthday dinner celebration with um, me and my sister and our friends, which was super fun. And then they all like went out and stuff and they're all spending the night at my friend's apartment. But I have work the next three days, so here I am. Everything's pretty much ready for work tomorrow. Got my heater on, it was cold. I went to bed at like 11 30. Oh, and someone asked me in my last video where I get these masks from. Case Defy sent them, and they are pretty durable. I like them, but anyway, I'm walking in. I look like a pack meal. Pack meal? I don't know. Okay. It's 10 12 a.m. I have my labor patient today. Hopefully, she'll deliver, um, and I get to experience the whole thing. It's going good. Lots of charting. Um, fetal heart rate strips as well as contractions so it's going good and yeah 
I'm a little bit stressed, but I'm with an awesome preceptor today. It's 12.22, going to get some lunch. I did pack a lunch today, but I'm gonna see if they have anything good in the cafeteria. It is 7.42, I'm getting ready to leave work now. Um, today was a good day, but we didn't get to see, we like just missed my patient giving birth, which kind of sucks when you miss them you know, giving birth when you've been with them the whole day, but it was like kind of during report time and we had just, you know, switched things over and we were finishing up our charting for the night. And then we had seen that she had given birth, but um, yeah. So anyway, I am on my way home now and going to shower and then go to sleep because I have two more 12s. Good morning guys. It is Monday, April 11th. It's my mom's birthday Eve. It is 6.39 a.m. Guys, my eyes are so swollen. Yesterday was like, it went good, but I was just like, I got super anxious. And like, I just had like a little bit of a breakdown last night. So yeah, um, but I'm, I'm doing okay. And I hope today is good. So that's my little update for you guys right now. I'm very tired, but I went to bed like nine, maybe like right before 10, so. Yeah, but I hope today is good and I just need to like take deep breaths and do my best. But I'm getting coffee and I can't wait because I need some. But it's going good so far. I'm with on the postpartum team today. I so it is 7.40 p.m. right now. I am getting ready to leave work. You can hear it's raining, but today went well. I had three moms, three babies and yeah, so tomorrow I am in a C-section. I'm like scrubbing in with the scrub nurse to be a scrub nurse, which I'm anxious about. So whatever, there's nothing I can do. If I get yelled at, I get yelled at. All right, so I'm going home and probably gonna eat and then sleep and we're back. But tomorrow is my Friday and my third, so. Today went a lot better. Good morning, you guys. It's 6.41 a.m. It is Tuesday, April 12th, my mom's birthday. Um, and I am going to be in a C-section this morning at nine. I believe it's at nine. So um, I hope it goes okay. And then I have my neonatal resuscitation like class um, from one to three today. So, yeah, I'm hoping today goes fast. It's definitely getting lighter in the morning. So yeah, let's let's go have a good day. I'm tired, but that's okay. Let's have a good day. It is 11.20 and I just got out of a C-section. Oh my gosh, you guys, it was so, it was crazy. It was intense. At one point there was like 25 people like in there or like waiting outside. I was like counting, it was crazy. Oh my gosh, but it went well. Mom and baby are okay. And that's my little update for right now. I do have a laboring patient and then I have my neonatal resuscitation class from I think one to three or one to four today. So it's 11.41, I'm running down to eat before my class. And I'm also gonna call my mom and wish her a happy birthday and see how her day's going. Even though I saw her this morning, but I miss her. So that's what I'm gonna do and I'm so hungry. And I am ready to eat. But... That feeling when you just bring a new life into the world and you're done with your third shift in a row and you get to go on vacation and the sun's still out. Great feeling. Hello guys. So it is like three o'clock maybe right now it is wednesday april 13th it is my birthday and i am spending my birthday how i love to spend most of my days which is getting starbucks which they didn't have the drink i wanted so i got like a frozen lemonade and it is melted so fast like look it just looks gross so that's really sad, but um, yeah, I just showered and um, I am about to watch some YouTube videos and true crime and eat some peanut butter crackers. So that's what I'm doing. And 
It's like kind of cloudy and rainy right now. It was super sunny this morning, but yeah, I do need to start like packing and getting my life together. Good morning, you guys. So it is 1049. It is Thursday, April 14th, and I just got my nails and toes done. These are my vacation nails. It's like a, it was called Pink Birthday, which is so fun. And it's like a gel color. It was like 011. I really like it. And now I'm getting Starbucks. Um, and hopefully I'm at a different Starbucks today. So hopefully they have that drink and then I might grab a bagel quickly. And then I have a wax appointment at like two something, I think. So I'm going to go home and start packing because I am way behind you guys, way behind. Hi, um, can I please get a large strawberry refresher with lemonade and no berries? Yeah, anything else? Uh, that'll be it. Yeah, they have it. Woo! Oh my goodness. I like was so boring for my birthday, but I did what I loved, just doing nothing. And yeah, the weather was like nice. It was like warm, but it was like kind of crappy, like rainy and stuff. And then I did go to um, dinner. I decided to go to Macaroni Grill and I just met our, me and Antonio went together and he got me um, like flowers and a cute little cake and a card and the cake was really good but anyway I am now waiting in line and because I was taking a nap and just not productive yesterday I need to pack because we leave tomorrow morning at like seven or something while we're here I'll give you guys a little update on work while I'm waiting so on Sunday I was I had my first labor and I was so like overwhelmed I think and um, I was with someone different than my preceptor and she was very, very nice, but I don't think she was the best at explaining things, um, but she was just so nice and I think I was just very overwhelmed. I was overwhelmed with like titrating the um, Pitocin and like stuff like that, the um, reading like the screens, the strips, charting it. And then on Monday, I was postpartum again, which I love. I feel so like comfortable and confident and I love the teaching aspect when patients are being discharged. I love to like teach. And then um, on Tuesday, so yeah, Tuesday, it was a little bit crazy because I was in for a C-section in the morning scrubbing, but I didn't end up scrubbing. I was watching because it was a very um, like stressful case for <clears throat> Sorry, it was a very stressful case for everybody and some things were like unpredictable, but everything is okay. Mom and baby are well and um, yeah, so I ended up just washing and then I like came back, ate lunch quickly and then I had to, I was in the OR longer than expected because the doctor was running late. We were already scrubbed in, so we were in there for hours <laughs> and then um, trying to think, oh, I had lunch and then I had my neonatal resuscitation, like three hour, like class I had to do stuff online and then I, we had in person so I like passed so I'm like certified for neonatal resuscitation and then that went to like 3 30 and so then I had like 3 30 to 7 30 of like actually with my patient and she ended up like being complete like out of nowhere and it was amazing she had her baby and it was a surprise and so it was so happy when like you know the gender was revealed it was just amazing as well as I got um, two nursing students in there with um, us too because I wanted them to see and they were like so kind and so grateful and they were from the school I graduated from so you know a little bias there and I try to you know help you know all the students as much as I can because it makes a huge difference and yeah so that was kind of this week so I'm five weeks down of my 16 week orientation which is crazy so I'll be off in July I think like July 3rd it's my first day off I'm not sure it's going good it's stressful but good but stressful but good so I love your jewelry you're welcome it is it is so bright it's like right like hitting in your face <laughs> thank you can I get a straw too thank you thank you thanks you too Yay! We got the Starbucks! My favorite drink! Strawberry refresher. Lemonade. No berries. I don't like the berries in the drink. I like choke on them. <laughs> if like, I don't have a straw. 
uh, what I've been waiting for. So good. Get me in the beach vibe. All right, let's go get a bagel. All right, people are driving reckless over here. It's spring break now, so people don't care. friends just dropped off a birthday gift and look how cute um i'm obsessed it's so cute oh my goodness this is so cute this is the a rescue kit i'm so excited to try this and then she got me this beautiful candle it smells so pretty So I'm all ready. I'm wearing this long black dress from Shein and I'm just wearing my hair and a ponytail. But here is my makeup. And yeah, I'm definitely like very burnt. I just put on like aloe and moisturizer. So yeah. You guys, look how gorgeous this is. Oh my goodness. This is so gorgeous. So I don't know if I've even mentioned we flew into Tampa and then we drove, we got like a van and we're at Siesta Key for seven, eight days and today is Saturday and it's so pretty. I slept in, we had to wake up at three yesterday to get to the airport. So yeah, but it's so pretty out. Um, I'll hopefully get better footage on my camera. My camera's upstairs and I didn't want to take it to the beach but I'm walking down wearing this bathing suit from Shein or like this whole set. And yeah, so I got my cute Victoria's Secret beach bag and I'm gonna meet my family and all their friends at the beach right now. Telling me lies, making me cry, the whole time, so just be careful what you take for granted. 